Folks, uh, today the question is uh, for 2018, October, November, paper 1-3, and uh, the question number is 12. So it is concerned with the chapter forces or moment or torque, whatever we say. Uh, it shows uh, four diagrams uh, in which it says that a flat metal disc, so metal disc is a flat one, has radius R, so all of them have radius R. On a forces of magnitude F, actually they have got different other magnitudes as well, but it says just uh, F, I don't know why. Uh, forces of magnitude F are, so this is actually 2F actually, I forgot. So uh, forces of magnitude F are applied tangentially at the edge of the disc. So all the forces applied tangentially along the edge of the disc. And the forces are in the plane of the disc. That means if the disc is here, the force is not like this. It goes also like this, like this. So if the disc is like this, the force is going like this, not like this or not like this. If the plane is somewhat like uh, this, the force should be exactly like this not like this or not like this. So, same plane. So, we have to uh, identify which arrangement of forces produces only a torque of magnitude 2 fr. So, you have to identify the picture or the diagram in which uh, these forces give a torque of 2 fr and it says only. Only means there should be torque only, nothing else. There should be torque only, nothing else. Then let us uh, go for the first diagram here. In the first diagram, uh, the torque will be overall clockwise, clockwise. So the torque given by this force will be equal to F into R, F into R. The torque given by this force will be equal to again F into R. And both of them try to move this thing clockwise. So the total torque is, total torque will be equal to, in case of A, we will have FR plus FR, that will be equal to 2FR. The torque is 2FR. But there is a complication here. The question says only a torque. So here we have to see whether it produces something else as well. In relation to torque, let us see if it produces something else as well and it does. It produces a resultant force. It is because here we have the force in direction like this. One force is like this and the other force is like this. So that is why we will have some sort of resultant force here. So even to the criteria of the question, this is not correct because it says only a torque. But this produces also force. So, A is incorrect. Now, if I go through choice number B, choice number B. So, here what happens is the torque produced by this thing is equal to F into R, F into R, F into R plus the torque given by this is equal to again F into R. So, it is FR. The total is 2FR. So, it also produces a torque 2FR. Let us see if it produces something else. It does not because here the forces are in exactly opposite directions. So, if so, they will give zero force. They will give zero force or they will give zero resultant force. So, that is why it produces torque only and it should be the correct answer. It should be the correct answer. Let us go through others as well. So, here we have got 2F into R plus 2F into R. So, both clockwise 2F into R plus 2F into R is 4FR. And the torque is not 2FR, totally is not 2FR. And also it produces some uh, force as well, resultant force, same as in case number A. And also it will be 2F, 2F into R, so 2F into R plus 2F into R, which will be equal to 4FR. It does not produce any resultant force, but uh, it produces a torque of 4FR, which is not correct. So that is why choice number B should be the, choice number B should be the, correct answer as it produces only a torque and does not produce any linear force. So, this should be the correct answer.